The overall goal of the following experiment is to measure intracellular and extracellular protein stabilities in living zebrafish embryos. This is achieved by tagging a protein of interest with a photoconvertible fluorescent protein and by injecting mRNA encoding the fusion as well as a fluorescent dye into zebrafish embryos. Next, the photoconvertible fusion protein is photoconverted, which pulse labels the protein. In this example, the fusion protein is secreted. Then, the decay in intra- and extracellular photoconverted fluorescence intensity is monitored over time and fitted with an exponentially decreasing function in order to determine the intracellular and extracellular half-lives of the fusion protein. The results show the in vivo stability of photoconvertible fusion proteins based on the decay in fluorescent signal over time. This method can help answer key questions in the fields of cell and developmental biology. For example, how stability influences protein distribution and availability. We are using our software PyFDAP for the analysis of FDAP data. PyFDAP is freely available on our webpage. After generating capped mRNA encoding a green to red photoconvertible fusion protein of interest, transfer approximately 30 one-cell stage zebrafish embryos to a 5 cm diameter glass or agarose coated plastic petri dish containing approximately 8 milliliters of embryo medium. Add 2 milliliters of previously prepared and thawed pronase stock solution to the